and welcome to another problem solving session guys so in this session we are going to take up this question which says that if in the given figure triangle edc and eba so check triangle ebc edc so e d c so this is the triangle they are talking about edc and eba eba are similar okay so let me remove these lines so that yeah, it's clear, right? So these these are the two similar triangles. BEC is given to be 115 degrees C and EDC is 70 degrees C. So find out DEC. So all these angles are to be found out. So this angle X and um, let me use another color to write this. So this is X and what DCE. D C E. So let this be Y. So we have to find out Y. What else? Uh, e A B. E A B. Let this be Z. Z A E B. A E B. Let this be U. And E B A. E B A. Let this be V. Okay. So let's now prove. And fine basically so there are a few things which are clearly understood um, that is X is equal to U because of vertically opposite angles but let's start with this given thing so triangle E D C is similar to triangle E B A E B A okay so this is given so that means what Corresponding angles will be equal. So angle E is angle E anyways. So angle D is going to be equal to angle B. Correct. Angle D is going to be angle B. So hence angle EDC is going to be equal to angle EBA. And EDC if you see in the figure it's uh, 70 degrees. So EBA is 70 degrees. So hence we get V angle V is equal to 70 degrees. First one done. Okay, now similarly you can say, um, now you can say in triangle, see in triangle EAB, EAB. So if you see 115 degrees in external angle, right? So angle BEC is equal to, if I write BEC, this is equal to Z plus V. And why is this? This is because of external angle is equal to sum of interior opposite angles. Isn't it? Interior opposite angles. Right? So, sum of interior opposite angles. So, hence, now V already I know that is 70. BEC is given. That is 115. So, I can write 115 degrees is equal to Z plus 70 degrees isn't it so clearly angle z is equal to 115 degrees minus 70 degrees which is nothing but 45 degrees so z becomes 45 degrees okay z is 45 degrees no problem so dce is or sorry uh, bae bae is right so hence we have completed this as well so eab so this is angle eab let me write this as eab and what else did we find out eba so this is also done so these two are done now since again let's use the similarity since dce triangle edc is similar is similar to triangle eba eba therefore Therefore, what do we get? We can say angle C, right? That is angle ECD is equal to angle EAB. And that is equal to Z. And that we found out is equal to 45 degrees. Correct? So Y also is now known. Y is 45 degrees, right? So what was Y by the way? EAB. So we are done with, Um, sorry. Uh, ECD right so DC this is also done okay now what X and U only have to be found out so clearly 
x is nothing but 180 degrees minus 70 degrees minus y which is 45 degrees isn't it and why is this angle sum property guys so this is because of angle sum property property of a triangle okay so that means x is clearly 180 minus 70 is 110 110 minus 45 is 65 degrees so we get x as 65 degrees and this will be equal to u as well why because of vertically opposite angles right so d c e and e, uh, sorry d e c d e c is done and a e b is also done both are same so a e b and d e c both are 65 degrees so all set right so i hope you understood this problem so it was a very simple problem we had to invoke some of our knowledge of previous grades of triangle sum uh, angle sum property of a triangle and external exterior angle is equal to sum of interior opposite angles so these things you must remember and using that and the concept of similarity we could achieve the results